Hey, hi, welcome to my YouTube channel, Tech Grantha. So uh, today we are going to start the new video series about the performance testing tool, which is the Blaze Meter. And uh, if anyone uh, missed to subscribe the channel and uh, share that video to your friends and colleagues. And uh, directly you can just go that uh, uh, link also, so which can be on board you on uh, playlist uh, dashboard. So let's start uh, about uh, the Blaze Meter session. And today I'm just going to discuss about the introduction for the Blaze Meter. So uh, the first thing is like we need to understand uh, what is the CA Blaze Meter. So uh, one important thing is like in the performance testing, we are using that uh, platform that the tool is going to uh, use for the act test execution a lot of other multiple activities also we can do using the blaze meter so that is uh, available to provide the below four solutions one thing is like simulate the test users from the cloud and behind your firewall so nowadays everyone knows like the project is working on the cloud we are doing the lot of cloud migration uh, so uh, the blaze meter are uh, available to do the uh, test executions on the cloud level as well. Uh, the second thing uh, that is an open source scripting tool which we can record and just uh, play the uh, test execution and do the activities according to the requirement of the business. Uh, the third thing is like uh, there is no any restriction about the load and we can use uh, a huge load for the testing as well as the uh, continuous performance testing also we can do uh, using the CI CD pipeline uh, uh, if we are going to use the DevOps tool like the Docker, Kubernetes and uh, Jenkins, all those things we can integrate and using the JMeter and the Blaze Meter, we can do the execution activities as well. The last thing is like uh, it is extremely fast to meet the enterprise goal uh, because and another big thing is like that is open source tool. So no any license is required for that. So some of the things we can do the uh, uh, free of cost and when we go on the enterprise level so uh, we can make the secure and just go ahead the license uh, level also okay so uh, there we are going to discuss about the feature of the blaze meter so the first feature is like that is 100 percent open source capability tool where we can just learn and just go ahead for the work okay the another thing is like that is performance test uh, test also we can do using that terrace and we can just go ahead for the exposure about that uh, uh, test and all those things for the performance okay the third thing is like that is pure SAS module there is no any setup is required like if you compare with the load runner uh, we need to download the file we need to do some uh, uh, setup is required to do the activities have the, some configuration about the uh, memory and uh, desk all those things but for the blaze meter uh, and all those activities is no need any of the setups on there the third thing is like that is the public cloud virtual private behind the firewall so all those things we can just do inside the blaze meter and the most important feature about the blaze meter is that is a massive massively scal scalable so that means there is a more than 2 million virtual user we can do the execution and we can go ahead for the performance we can find out the performance bottlenecks all those activities we can do using the blaze meter tool okay so a part of that the blaze meter supports uh, um, like the multiple uh, type of uh, work also so like we can use uh, for the performance testing we can use the blaze meter for functional testing Using the Blaze Meter, we can go ahead for the mock services. So mostly the mock services are using for the server virtualization activities where we are going to use uh, CA dev test tool uh, to mock the service and just go ahead for the virtualization work. So that also we can do using the Blaze Meter tool. Uh, another feature is uh, support is like API monitoring also we can do use the Blaze Meter. So uh, down to line whenever I will show that the Blaze Meter dashboard. So there you can just integrate your any of the monitoring tool like the Dynatrace, AppMon, AppDynamics, Neuralink, all those tools you can integrate in the Blaze Meter. And also that the on-premise machines also we can just um, integrate and that is support all those uh, discuss feature. So uh, 
down to line we are just that is only the introduction part have the basic overview what is the blaze meter what is the features supports all those activities uh, the next video session we will discuss how can we download the blaze meter how the ui will be look like after uh, go on the blaze meter dashboard and later on we can just go ahead for one by one uh, test execution all those activities about the blaze meter okay so uh, thank you so much to uh, watch that video and just share your friend and colleagues to uh, share the feedback also in the comment box so i can just uh, make more better and more useful sessions on further and uh, if anyone have suggestion you can also just comment on the comment box okay thank you so much thanks to all